So today, we're gonna to be changing the air filter on this 2009 Renault Clio 1.2 TCE. So first thing we need to do is just release the bonnet. So the air filter on the TCE engine is slightly different to the normal engine. You can see it here and the housing's a lot different to the longer one that you get just on the plain petrol ones. In order to access the air filter, you need to obviously take this cover off. And what you've got is kind of these clips, one on each side. So just in here, what you kind of got is this bit that drops down behind here. So to get it off, you can just get a plastic pry or a screwdriver or something in there, just to push it in as you pull it up. And you can just see that kind of lip on that side that clicks in underneath this tab. So I just did one on the other side as well. There we go. And with them both removed, now we can see the air filter. To take the filter out of the housing, first you have to push it down and then you can pull it towards you and away it comes. Inside the housing, you can see if there's any debris. We've got loads of old bits of leaves and stuff like that. So what I'm gonna do is just get Hoover in there quickly and clear all that out. The filter itself sits within a smaller housing. So just underneath what you can do, just give it a little push forward if it doesn't come out and then it just drops out and comes away. Simple as that. You can then bring in your new filter pop it in, just make sure it aligns properly. And then just around the seams, around the edges, you'll find that it just needs to insert straight into those. Just a little squeeze to make sure that it's airtight all the way around. And there we go, now it's ready to put back in. You can see from the housing that it'll only go in one way, obviously because it's got the different edges and the different lugs. And the bit that we said about where we need to pull it down and then push it back up when we refit it, go in a particular direction. So that direction is kind of this grid piece to the bottom. So I slide it in initially. Offer it in. Once it's in there, just push it up. And that kind of seals all the way around it and makes it airtight. And then what keeps it in place on the cover housing, you can see it's got these lugs. So there you go in, just kind of underneath this bit here, and obviously that wedges it up and makes sure it stays there. So what we'll do is just offer it in, make sure that they go in, make sure your clips either side are aligned, pop them in, and you should just get a nice little click as they go in. There we go. Once you're done there, obviously shut your bonnet down. And that's it, you're done. So that's it, all done for now. So hopefully that's been useful to someone. If you've enjoyed it or found it useful, give us a like down below. If you haven't done so already, remember to hit subscribe coming up here now. Like I always say, there's so much coming up on the channel. There's so many videos that we're gonna do. We've got lots to do on this car. So for now, really appreciate your time for watching. Thanks very much and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.